video of a scary clown in Albuquerque's Bosque is becoming a hit and has a lot of people wanting to know the story behind it. News 13's Francesca Washington knows the answer. She is live near Central and Tingley. Francesca. Kim, even if you've never seen the movie It, you recognize the haunting clown Pennywise. But the man says he wasn't there to scare anyone. People go to the Bosque to walk their dogs, ride their bikes, or enjoy a nice run. It's because it's really beautiful and peaceful out here. So the last thing they expect to see is a clown sitting alone at a picnic table. My dog is part pit bull, so it'd be kind of funny to see Hank chase after him and we'd see how scary he really was. I am not afraid of clowns. I don't have that phobia and I'm a big fan of Stephen King movies, so I would probably be really excited to see Pennywise. The Pennywise impersonator was spotted in the Bosque on Sunday, and those who saw him were caught off guard, to say the least. <laughs> He even got the attention of 93.3 radio personalities Carlos and Kiki. He looks scary. Oh, he's so scary. We caught up with a man whose real name is Everett Wilbanks. He says someone even reported him to the police while he was roaming the Bosque on Sunday. I went over there, I talked to them, and uh, they assured me that I wasn't doing anything illegal. And they just said it was just weird. When he's not covered in clown makeup, he works in construction. Wilbank says he was meeting a photographer for a cosplay photo shoot. Cosplay is when you uh, act in costume. Wilbank says he's used to people freaking out at first, but eventually they approach him. Because it is a scary costume, but I'm not a scary person. He says he dresses up as Pennywise to bring laughter and entertainment. Clown lives matter too. Not all clowns are scary. But has this word of advice if you ever encounter a clown that's too close for comfort? If one is stalking you, yeah, get away. Wilbank says he made that costume himself, and he usually just dresses up for events like Comic-Con, but in October, he says he wears it all month long for Halloween. Back to you. Okay, thanks, Francesca. Now, the video of him in the Bosque has already gotten almost 150,000 views since it was posted on Sunday.